Today we're going to check out the Latitude 7480's internals. So to access the internals, it's not that difficult. You've just got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight captive screws. So captive meaning the screws will stay in place when uh, when you um, have unscrewed them fully. So you can actually take out from the hinge and then just pull the back cover off where you have a variety of different labels. And autofocus is dead on this video recording. Oops. And then just some molding to perhaps indicate production date or batch number. We have a lonely uh, QR. We have QR codes, more moldings. And it looks dirty, but it's actually not. This is what it is. The dual speaker grill. And then this is the internal. It's on it itself. Um, we have our what's interesting that caught my eyes is that we we have a slot for the SIM card, but because um, we don't actually have the LTE chip in this system, it has a placeholder. I wonder if you can just remove this. Um, it's quite it's kind of stuck. Um, Never mind. I'm not gonna injure my arm. I uh, injure my hands in doing trying to do that. Okay, let's take a look at this. So, barrel jack is a separate component to the motherboard. So if it wears down, you can replace it. USB ports are soldered, so if it wears down, you will need to resolder them. It looks like the USB three port has an extra bracing, so it should you know be more secure. Got a sixty watt hour battery. It looks like a four cell unit. And it's a standard lithium polymer affair. So lithium ion affair, sorry. Of 7.6 volts. Let's try to not move the laptop too much so that the camera can remain in focus. The electivity LED is connected to the main board through a cable. We've got our speaker that's running the bottom here, up here. And then the CMOS battery is really accessible here. Seems to be some blanking spot here. Presume is there models equipped with fingerprint sensors? Because that looks like an ideal spot for a fingerprint sensor. I am not sure. Let's see. Finger print. Um, fingerprint reader. Okay, some models are equipped with fingerprint reader. So I presume that's where it will go. M.2 2280 drive. This particular one is populated with a micron. One one zero zero five twelve gig, uh, SATA three gigabits uh, compatible 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 uh, capable at drive, dual DDR four sodium modules. The fan intakes air through the bottom of the case and then just blows it out the back. So this is a system where okay, it's not through the top of the hinge. It's through the bottom of the hinge. It's a bit of a restrictive design, but I guess it works. Uh, we, we do have the LTE uh, WWAN chip. We can put one here. Although, interestingly, there is no antenna suite. Um, there doesn't seem to be any antennas pre run for that chip. This is the wireless card. It is an Intel 8265NGW chip. And I presume that these two ribbon cables that are hidden behind the battery. These are for the trackpad and keyboard, presumably. Over here, this is the connector for the battery. And that is the connector for the display. Although I'm not sure what this is. Um, oh, this is for the IR. So that's for the IR. And then there's a TS here. I'm not sure what TS stands for. So yeah, that is going to be the internals of this Dell Latitude 7480.